We have all been taught that William Harvey discovered blood circulation in the 17th century, but what if I told you someone figured it out 300 years earlier, and most people have never heard his name? In the year 1242, in Damascus, a Muslim scholar named Ibn al-Nafis made a breakthrough that would change medicine forever. While Europe still believed ancient Greek ideas, Ibn al-Nafis was studying the human body with fresh eyes. He discovered pulmonary circulation, that blood leaves the right side of the heart, travels to the lungs where it picks up oxygen, and then flows back to the left side of the heart, ready to fuel the body. This was revolutionary. Ancient medicine claimed blood passed directly through invisible holes in the heart's wall. Ibn al-Nafis boldly wrote, there is no pathway between the two sides of the heart except through the lungs. The sad part, his work was written in Arabic and for centuries it stayed locked away in manuscripts. Europe would not discover the same idea until the 17th century, and by then Ibn al-Nafis's name was almost forgotten. But history does not lie. Ibn al-Nafis was the first to describe it accurately, proof that the Islamic Golden Age was centuries ahead of its time. So, how many other discoveries were made long before we think? That is a story for another time. Follow for more hidden history.